there by the time we bring this up the episode airs and we'll probably all be flying around but um Ooh, that's right there is a there was a tweet <laughs> from uh that originated on black twitter we love you black twitter that reads as black people genetically we are stronger and smarter than everyone else we are more creative on december 21st our real dna will be unlocked and majority will be able to do things that we thought were fiction learn who you are as people they want to make us average this has exploded and I believe this episode will drop on the 22nd. So by that time, the three of us should be uh, <laughs> <Baby>. <laughs> leaping tall buildings. <laughs> <Baby>. <laughs> so I wanted to know what, what superpowers you would have. Oh. Man. Mm. If I could get three more inches, man, we good. <laughs> <laughs> you can choose anything you want. <laughs> I can. Ah. Okay. Mm. Mm. Um, go to Carmelo first. I don't know. Um, I would probably <laughs> choose um teleportation. I mean, just amazing. It could just go wherever I wanted. <laughs> That's such a Carmelo answer. <laughs> The thing, that I, know, you will the thing that I know about late. Car- <laughs> that's what I, about, I was exactly what I was going to say. She strolled right on in. Oh, 15 minutes late. It only took me four seconds to get here. <laughs> How is that possible? <laughs> what? But I could go with, anywhere. With Starbucks in her hand. With Starbucks. Yeah. It's true. Um, that sounds like a lame power. <laughs> <laughs> that or telekinesis, but then I would just be really lazy with that too. Telekinesis, like, oh, so you I can just find got in bed and then I just close my door. Huh? Telekinesis, so oh, so you could control other, like you can move things. things with your mind. Whack. That's like Matilda. Nah. So you want to be like a white girl? Mm. I've been, I've been trying to read you. <laughs> That, what about, um, what about invisibility? That'd be cool. Yo, I got some questions for you about invisibility. Okay. They are very inappropriate. What would you do? Like, what would be the top, like, the first five things you would do as an invisible person? I feel like, I think I said this once on the pod, but I don't remember what it was in regards to, but I feel like I might, like, take some stuff. We incriminating ourselves this episode. I said I'm gonna twist babies upside down. You're talking about, <laughs> you're talking about I'm gonna go, I'm I don't gonna do steal. it now. I'm just saying if you I ever, had... yo, you ever had a, stri- a stealing streak? Um, no. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, last year. I <laughs> well, um, not since COVID. <laughs> COVID kind of new, yo. <laughs> All right, so you would be <laughs> invisible. So aside from steel things, like what would you? Uh, I don't know because I feel like in being invisible, it's kind of sneaky. Mm-hmm. So I'm just like I'm not quite sure what I would want to do with that sneakiness. Um, because it's not like I'd be checking on anyone's phone. Man, I'd be jumping right on into the room. Man, you know what? I've always wondered how this person brought it down. And then make fun of them. Or, I mean, I don't know. What can I do that's invisible that I can, like, just get a lot of money? Steal a bank? Rob a bank? Um, I mean, the money's not invisible. What yes. if I put it in my bra? That is a big bra. <laughs> well, I guess if your clothes <laughs> are invisible. <laughs> yeah, I'm not naked. <laughs> I don't know. Like then, I, I guess the bra is full, so it doesn't quite work. Oh my gosh! I'm just um, ta- I'm just talking logistics here. Nah, it doesn't quite work that way. I don't know. You would need you to be taking red that money is invisible, month. like you are. Because mm. mm. I, I don't think your clothes would be invisible. 
So in order to be invisible, I would have to be naked. Mm -hmm. Who is yeah. making these rules? This has never been. I don't know. No, this, 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 this seems correct. No, it seems correct. Yeah. Uh, according to the science of the blockbuster hit Hollow Man. <laughs> He's need... naked. Yeah, he has to be naked. Who else be invisible? Blockbuster. Uh, <laughs> don't act like you've never seen it come. I did not go watch Hollow Man. I ain't seen Hollow Man and I ain't seen The Bodyguard. Uh, <laughs> uh -huh. Both with Whitney Houston. Um, <laughs> yeah, I guess I, you're making points. I'm just, I've never really thought about I would have to be naked. Rashawn, what powers are you going to get? You want to try to be dark skin for a couple days? <laughs> sure. Um, for sure, I want to fly. Cute. Yeah. And I think I would want to. I've always wanted to have storms powers. Uh -oh. Just control the weather. Wait, so you always want to have what? Because I lost you. Storm. You want to be able to control the storms? Control the weather, yeah. I always thought that was just so cool. It would be cold and rainy every single day if you were controlling the weather. Let's be real. Yeah, but I could fly. I could I could make it a sunny day. No, I would go to the beach with you finally, but I would be like the right temp. You don't go to the beach? I don't I I don't, I don't either. I hate the beach. I get heat rashes and it's just really bad. <laughs> I do. It's really bad. Oh my goodness! Why don't you go to the beach? You don't like sand. I hate the sand. I hate people looking at me, and then I gotta get naked. I I haven't eaten a vegetable in seven years. Ah, ah! I'm good. I hate the beach. Then you get your shoes all dirty. I hate it. Ah, gross. I hate it. I hate it. But I do like it at night. It's nice, you know, to go out there and walk mm. and whatnot. All right, so you got some good ones. Carmela's still trying to think about her power so she could steal from people. Why don't you just vote for a socialist? Teleport. <laughs> she would tele oh, teleport. teleport. Mm. Or if, ah. I could, if I could read people's minds, that'd be cool. No, because then you'd find out what they actually think about you. And we love you. Mm. So much. Mm. <laughs> you did you. <laughs> <laughs> <Can't be. laughs> um, ah, I, I, I was thinking about it. There's so many different powers that I, I would like to have. Some of it is like, oh, if I only I could make X amount of money. But then a different power was like, if I can control my body at a snap. Oh. You know, like like <clears throat> if I can morph my body into anything at any point in time. So it could be like. One day I'm, I don't know, super, super buff. And then another day I like grow extra gills or something. Like, oh, I grow gills and I could breathe underwater. Like I could just morph my body into whatever kind of thing. But then I was like, how's that going to make me some money? Like, I don't know. You know, I'm trying to figure it out. But I do want to just have ultimate control of my body. That's how I'm going to get the extra three inches. That's uh, that's actually a a, a black X Man. His name is Darwin. Man, you whack as hell. Never mind. I don't want it. Does he get the extra three inches? I don't Does know he? about that. But his body adapts to any situation around him so that he survives. So if he fell in the water, he would grow gills mm. so he didn't drown. He would get three inches if he wanted it. <laughs> I'm talking about height. I'm talking about just height, like you know, so I don't right, have right, to wear right, my right, right, anymore. Right, 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 now that was it right there. Uh, I don't know. I, I, I like. I will, I've also thought about being like a super genius to where everything I do is successful. Um, that way, then I could. I don't know. I, I think. I think what I've heard about this tweet is that it's not to be played with. Okay, I heard it on Clubhouse when I was on there for five seconds. This lady said, y'all making jokes about this, but we're actually in a moment where um, this is divine intervention. God allowed the people, the blacks, to be enslaved for 400 years. And this is the final date of the 400th year. 
And this is when we open up our minds beyond that 10% of capability that most people are using their minds at, where we are going to elevate way above what we've always been. We're going to be smarter, faster, stronger. Imagine that. <sighs> Me, smarter, impossible. So I think now the superhero amongst us is truly probably going to be Rashawn. Because you're already like a elite intellectual with books. So <laughs> they're probably, you know, you're probably going to take your book knowledge and kind of to the next level. I stop yeah. reading books unless they're about money. So, you know, I don't care about Dr. Seuss. So, yeah, they're probably just going to make me as smart as Rashawn is. <laughs> Dr. Seuss currently. makes a lot of money. Dr. Seuss is dead, and I'm trying not to be that way. Well, his mm -hmm. estate. Oh, does he? What's his real name? Tell me right now. You know. I actually don't know. I think there was like a urban legend or myth or a, what's it called? Controversy? No, when it's like late. When it's. I can't because there's multiple the Dr. Seusses. Theory. There's a theory. Yeah. Or mm -hmm. that his wife was writing for him. I heard about that. I heard about that. Listen, man. Theodore. Women. Conspiracy. There's a conspiracy. Mm, not the spiracies. The spiracies. Uh, all right. When we come back, we're going to talk about other things. <laughs>